In a telephonic interview with NBC News, Deputy Commissioner Otili Kashupulwa said one of the vehicles was overtaking another when it collided with the oncoming vehicle. The oncoming vehicle was carrying a family believed to be from Germany. The mother, father and one of the daughters died on the spot while the 16-year-old daughter sustained major injuries. The other vehicle burst into flames and three occupants were burned beyond recognition apart from the driver who was pulled out of the flames by a witness. In a separate incident, a six-year-old boy died instantly after being hit by a car at Hentis Bay yesterday. He was identified as Adrian Engelbrecht. He was bumped while running over the street after his puppy. The Deputy Regional Commander Andreas Nelumbu urged all drivers to be cautious and drive within the prescribed speed limit. And considering that uh, we are not the only ones using the road, I think uh, our safety will be guaranteed. We should avoid unnecessary overtaking and uh, all other irresponsible driving that might cause uh, unnecessary loss of lives. Meanwhile, a local company donated refreshments, torches and reflect safety vests worth $5,000 towards the Irongo Road Safety Campaign. Namib Industrial Group owner Demufayo David commended the police for their efforts on the roads this festive season. This is very important to, to the police and we hope that it adds value in uh, ensuring our road safety. Uh, of our users and our citizens.